<laughs> this right here, this right here is crown fried hot sauce. Let's see what's in it. This is what he ate earlier. Ingredients. Water. Salt. Cow piss. <laughs> cow piss there. Monkey nut juice. Cow piss. <laughs> Frog gizzards. Yeah. I... The monkey nut juice <laughs> is the part. Where you throw that out the way. Yeah. Because ain't no way in the there world. No money, none of that stuff in there. This nigga, no. Yeah, this nigga so eat. High. Yo, no, for real. <laughs> Go read the ingredients. Go read the ingredients to the hot sauce from Crown Fried. First thing it says. Ingredients. Water. Salt. Cow piss. Monkey nut juice. And sodium. There you go. There you go. He don't believe nothing nobody say. All right, man. I got a question for you, man. All right, cool. Sweet. And don't rush into this one, because you'll be eager as shit. All right, cool. Listen. All right. Ready. All right, man. All right. The white girls... With fat asses think they special? Do white girls with fat asses think they special? Yeah. Why? Cause they now they now seem like or they, they come off as the uh so far as sexual more more dominant than the average black girl. Wait, so what does this have to do with black girls? Because the reason why, because they all, you know, blacks, black girls, white girls always had that little hood competition thing where which well, one was sexier. I, uh, no, I've never heard of that. <laughs> I said, okay, like, what I'm saying is, oh, man, it's about to be the one. Here we go. Here we go. I've never heard that. You know what I know for years. Okay. Majority, especially from the hood, black women. I'm not from problem. the hood. I don't know what you're talking about. You got to explain. Sorry, right. we ain't gonna say no more on that. We can talk. We can talk about this. Go ahead. No, go ahead. Go ahead. They, it's a bit of a little thing where if you if, if dudes, especially black dudes, like white girls, it's a competition thing in a black woman's mind. Black women always had them beat with their bodies. <laughs> their bodies have always had them beat. So now that white girls have the bodies, it's kind of like you know, black guys always want they slow bunnies anyway. But now they got the badass bodies. <laughs> Now they got the badass bodies. Uh -oh. It's way more competition. Yeah. Way more competition. And that makes a white girl, she, you best believe she in that mirror looking. Oh, All right. Oh. So look. So. <laughs> you know. All right. Let me say this. Because uh, I don't know where you're going with this. I don't know where I went. They know where I went. The audience knows where I went. Where you go? I don't, I don't know. know. Matter of fact. Since I'm saying that, double and down. I'm double and down. You're damn right. Since I'm saying that, I just got blocked because of that reason. I got blocked on Facebook because I went against a girl when she was saying a white girl that looked that good. I was like, she looked good to me. Oh, and since I like said, white girl? Since I said the B word, she got she she oh, reported me. So you called her a bitch. No, I ain't call her that. I just said that, that white bitch. bitch I said that white bitch looked good to me. She was like, she just she said before I after I right after I said that. She didn't block me until she was like, oh, I can't disagree. I was like, I didn't say you could disagree. I'm just telling you she looked good to me. Once I said that again, she blocked me. How you know what she sounded like if it was in... If I'm just saying, she, that's just, you know, about the voice of girl make it. Like, I'm I don't know the voice of girl make it. That's, that's, that's my voice. Okay, okay. This is a voice. All right, okay, okay, all right, all right, all right. So, all right, so I don't understand that question. When men at when whenever we talk about white girls with fat asses, why do we automatically always associate them with black girls? It's the competition factor, man. I, that wasn't the question, man. But I said I told you why. Uh, yeah, that's your answer. Let okay, me get mine. Okay, my opinion. <laughs> they got me fat. <laughs> Yo, I'm saying it's always gotta be this thing 
where there's a competition. And the black man is always caught in the middle. Why? I'm not saying. I'm saying, do white girls think they're special yeah, yeah. because they got a fat ass? This has nothing to do with black girls. But you, when you asked me, you said why, and I explained why. Yeah, but but just because. Oh, okay, okay look, well, all right, all right. because they get because with the fat ass now they the competition of them getting. No, married. no, you already gave me an answer. Can I okay. give my answer? Right. You like you must like white girls with fat asses. Oh, like it's okay. So look, oh, it's not a race thing. Well, maybe, but not right now. It's not. I'm not saying you making it a race thing. I'm saying just talking to the people. It's not a race thing. All right, listen. So white girl with a fat ass. The reason why I think that it garners so much attention is because we were always told that white girls, or we was always looked that white girls never had fat asses. Correct. Can you answer that? That's true. Right? All right. But when you go down south, you've seen a lot of white girls with fat asses. <laughs> it was just up here for the most part. Now you're starting to see a lot of white girls with fat asses. Now, granted, you got some fat asses that been operated on. Yeah. Same thing with with any other race. But my question to you is why is the first thing you do is run to black girls when it comes to white girls with fat asses? Why can't it just be like, well, the reason why they think they're special because they get more attention from from men who like fat asses. Well, it has to be, well, <laughs> the reason why is because and what girls with fat asses? It's like it's like it's like this. Where, no, hold up, it's like this. Before you go, it's like this. This is what kills me. It's like white girls can't have fat asses because the only women on the planet is black girls with fat asses. That's not true. I'm not saying that. I'm saying this is how your argument is set up. Not- it is because you automatically compared them. What about? What about Brazilian girls with fat asses? Okay, them too. What about we, yo? You said the two main men. What about the main what about, what about, black girls? What about Spanish girls with fat asses? They do have Why the main be... competition was always black girls with white girls. With no, it's not. Girls. The main competition was always black girls. No, and white girls. And main competition with black girls and white girls is black men. It has nothing to do with their ass. Yeah, but the ass makes the black men come. No, and this is just recent though. You talking about? Say just recent. We've been like an athlete for, for decades, white, bro. Girl, white girls with fat asses are, are a phenomenon for the last 10 years. It ain't been a phenomenon since the 80s. Okay, yeah, the white girl themselves yeah. my ass. Yeah, white, white, girls with fat, that ass. white girls with fat asses. If you have a white girl, if you was a white girl with a fat ass, I would, no, hold I up, let me finish. Nigga, if you was a white girl with a fat <laughs> ass, not you, but if you was a white girl, well, I'm saying that wrong. Back in the day, mm-hmm. in the 80s, if you seen a white girl with a fat ass in the 80s, was she was considered fat. fat. Yeah. If you seen a black girl with a fat ass in the 80s, what? It was goddamn. Yeah, exactly. So you can't say that this was going on 90s. I would say the late 90s, 2000s is when it kind of started. That's when it started. Mm-hmm. So that's what I'm saying. So how are you comparing white girls with fat ass to black girls with fat asses? Why can't they just be their own separate entity and they just think but they're you special? you asked me why they're special. Yeah, I know. Why can't they be their own separate entity? Okay. If I said, if I said, why do black girls think they're special because they have big, bigger breasts? You're gonna say because they're in competition with white girls? Yup. No, you're not. <laughs> you're not gonna say that. You're not gonna say that. <laughs> what are you talking about? What are you gonna say? You wouldn't I say. Probably, you wouldn't say anything if I said, why do black girls feel special about this? You wouldn't say anything. Yes, I would. You, you, asked me something you would say no. You wouldn't say anything that has anything to do with white girls. I probably family. would actually. It depends yeah, on you what you might ask would. Me. It depends on what you ask me. Okay, white girls with blonde weave. That's the obvious setup for you. Yeah, they wouldn't have blonde weave. They mostly got blonde hair. What are you talking about? I'm talking about most black most black girls with with blonde hair. You said blonde white girls. Weave. With okay, blonde yeah. Weave. Okay, yeah, okay. White, white, uh, black girls with blonde weaves. Shit, they look good. They look good. I, but that has nothing to do with the looks. You know what I'm saying, with you, I'm saying, dog, it has nothing to do with the looks. I'm saying you automatically, the first thing you do 
is compare white girls to black girls. Once yeah. I say anything that has to do anything to do with bodies, because most you in your head, the only people with fat asses, number one is black girls. That's number one. Number two ain't white girls. It's probably Spanish girls. Number three, but you ain't, but the sole person with the fat asses in the world is black girls. That's in your head. So as soon as I say anything about a white girl, mm-hmm. well, the reason why is because they're giving white black girls competition and they're kind of mad. What are you talking about? Yeah, nigga, it's true. Say it ain't true. That's a different argument, though. Okay, well, okay, well, then. That's a different argument. Right, well, I agree with you then on the, on the black men competition thing. I would say that then. But I'm asking you, why do you feel as though white girls think that they're special now because they got fat asses? They get more attention. Yeah. Don't get, no, don't let me give you the answer. Come they're on, more man. Now. To who? To I know some white boys who don't think that. Okay, that's white some girls white are boys. fat, fat asses. Boys. I think they think they look terrible. That's some, but it's probably more of a percentage of niggas that want them now. Than it was. They niggas sick. want anything. Nah, well, it just looks good. Yeah, it don't have to look good. Come back. I know niggas and girls are terrible looking. They don't have to they look good. That. Then niggas want anything. Okay, cool. True. Whatever you say. I'm just saying they do. I don't think so. You don't think niggas don't niggas, but I, majority of niggas just don't want anything, bro. Not majority. <laughs> Come on, man. Come on, man. Majority of niggas don't just want anything. Come on, man. man. Come on. Man. They want to have some type of attraction. All right. Just like girls want men to have some type of attraction. I guess. Alright. So 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 your answer is what? They think they special now because what? Because they, because they they get more attractive, they more attractive. More attention, yeah. More attractive. attention. I can see that. I can see I can see white girls getting more attention because they got fat ass. But let me ask you. Let me let me take it a little bit deeper with you. Mm-hmm. We gonna get on some other girls, Spanish girls, Puerto Rican girls, right? Mm-hmm. Do you think Puerto Rican girls is the best of both worlds? And let me explain before you answer that. Okay, cool. Because you like to drive the train off the tracks. <laughs> <laughs> but you still want to like to drive the jump. train right but off the tracks. Still, conductor. But you still want to let me uh, drive the train. I think you need to still, turn here. You still let me drive the train. Sure. The river line right off the tracks. <laughs> <laughs> the man making the stallion. <laughs> <laughs> so, are black girls and white girls a fusion of Spanish girls? In niggas' heads, I'm saying. In niggas, like you know, they're doing like a bowl thing. Like this, they go like this. Ah! Like they're gonna do the fusion. Yeah, you can do it. Do you feel like black men think that because they get with a, a Spanish girl that because she got long hair <laughs> that she and she lighter? A lot of them do. That she's the <laughs> she's the mixture of black and white. I, a lot of them, I will admit a lot of them do. A lot of them do. A lot of black dudes do think Yo, let me let me explain something to y'all. I was true, a, listen, I was a dumb kid. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie to you. I was dumb. I was a dumb kid when I was a kid. I'm pretty smart now. <laughs> I was a dumbass kid, right? I literally used to think that Spanish women, black women, black women. were white women and black women. <laughs> like mixed. Yeah. Like a mixture. Yeah. Like, whoa. Well, if she black and she white <laughs> and she got long hair, light skin and kind of dark, <laughs> see in between the middle. <laughs> See black and white. Because oh. at the time when I was growing up, and when I was growing up, right, there wasn't really too many mixed kids in the hood. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Like, maybe a few, but for the most part, the mixed kids were cons- was considered black. You know what I'm saying? If you were mixed, if your mom was white or your dad was white, you were considered black. It wasn't no, oh, you're mulatto or you're mixed. It was just, oh, yeah, he's black. You know what I'm saying? That's just what it was. Um, now it's a little bit different, I would say. Like, it's still kids considered black, but, you know, they also, some kids also be like, well, I'm white. Back in the day, you couldn't do that. If you was, if you, if you had a baby with a, a black woman 
or a black man, and you came out, you bet not had ever said you was white. You just got to say that you're black. Mm -hmm. Ain't no white side, nigga. Nah, what happens when you drop black paint into a bucket of white paint and you mix it? What happens? Turns the color. <laughs> you know, that's the days to say. So, so I'm saying, I think that people, especially black men, us as black men, we do believe that. Now, I know that's going to come to a shock to some of you Spanish girls out there, <laughs> but we do believe that. It's the best of both worlds. Mm -hmm. Got us a white girl and a black girl mixed into one. Because <laughs> <laughs> off the looks. That's the worst mistake you'll make in your life. And it is. Because Spanish women are totally a Different. separate thing. Not a separate thing. Separate person, yep. I should say. And that's what I'm saying. So you believe that too. Hell no. I don't believe I don't know I know. Not. I know. I'm saying you believe that black men think is the best of both worlds. Oh, yeah, a lot of them do. Not all of them, but a lot of them do. Majority of them. I would say like a good 70% of them do. Yeah. They believe it. Yeah. That's the proof for us. They look at it that way, which is yeah. stupid. So that bitch pull a razor on your ass and takes you saying, oh, there we go, stereotypical shit. Nah, so, so Spanish women just carry razors. Not all. Not okay. all. They will, all right. they will get crazy on your ass. And you'll find out there. So let me ask you a question. Yeah. And don't hit me with the typical, well, it depends on who you're dealing with. God. It depends on who you're so dealing with. So it must be an individual person you're talking about. It depends on who you're dealing with. Okay, so don't hit me with that. All right, please. Sorry, please. Please. Please, right, please, please, please. White girl. Yeah. Fat ass. Mm -hmm. Cute. Okay. Look good. Black girl. Fat ass. Cute. Look good. Mm -hmm. Spanish girl. Fat ass. Cute. Look good. All three walk in the room. <laughs> Here we go. Which one you trying to holler at first? <laughs> so <funny. laughs> Yo. <laughs> Yo, so you gonna holler at the white girl first? Damn, ain't no racism voting this nigga body. Don't, don't, don't. I'm gonna tell you. Yeah. I don't keep real. I only spend my life. So, like three of them. Damn. See, that's <laughs> another thing. That's another thing. What? Black men count how many times they had white girls, right? <laughs> <laughs> it's like it's like a it's like a, a novelty. Yeah, like yeah. it's like a novelty. It's like oh. <laughs> I only had two of them. <laughs> I need at least five more. I need a collection. <laughs> I ain't got none of them, them, them white stallions in my stable. <laughs> Yo, I got a bunch of uh, black thunders in the stable, but I ain't got them, them white lightnings in there. Like, come on, bro. So that's what you said. Yeah, I'm doing the All right, okay. I got another one for you. You going to try to be smart. A smart Alec. Wow. <laughs> hey, that's you. Who's this? White girl with fat ass, look good, walk mm -hmm. in the room. Yeah. Black girl with fat ass, look good, walk in the room. Mm -hmm. Spanish girl with fat ass, look good, walk in the room. Asian girl, fat ass, look good, walk in the room. Who you talking to? First off the rip. And don't give me that cookie cutter answer. What's the answer? What's the cookie cutter answer? I don't know. I always wanted to say that. Asian girl. <laughs> Listen, let me explain something to y'all. Explain something to y'all. Black girls, black girls, white girls. Let me explain something to y'all. We want variety. Right? Listen, let me explain something to y'all about a black man. We watch Kung Fu movies. Oh, my God. What they got to do with ass, man? This has a lot to do with ass. We watch, lot, we watch Kung Fu movies when we're young, right? You yeah. watch Kung Fu movies. Can we do it when we're young, do right? Ass right? I don't know about him. Mm -hmm. But all the Chinese girls were... <laughs> <laughs> Maylings, all the Maylings? Yeah. I always wanted to fuck the Maylings. <laughs> I ain't gonna lie. I did. So, I'm saying... 
he going to pick the Asian girl. Because mm -hmm. most black men, we like exotic women. Now, just because you're Asian doesn't make you exotic. Just, let's just get that out the way. But in our heads, if you're from another race, <laughs> you're exotic. <laughs> If we can't get Listen, Nelly, if I can't pronounce what race you are or what nationality you are, you're exotic to me. You are. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. Right. For real, that's what you do. Yeah, yeah. Asian girls. So you pick an Asian girl? Why? She got fat ass. Not because she's Asian. You only had one in life. Knock it off. You never you never messed with an Asian yeah, girl did. before. Yeah, I did. No, you didn't. Yes, I did. Where she was from? She lived in the hood. She lived in Cali. She ain't from she ain't Asian then. What are you talking about? Because she Asian. What was she, she looked? Did she look Asian? She was Asian. She okay. was Asian descent. Was she did was she dark or light? I would say light. Like like Chinese or like 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 what? she was Filipino. Yeah, then that's different. That's They're black. Asian. They're, They're black. Not, oh my god. Filipinos are black. They're listen, Asian. if you listen, They're if like, all you niggas, I don't care what he's talking about. If all you niggas out there, if any of you niggas slept with a Filipino girl, you slept with a black girl. Don't hit me with the whole none of that. No. You slept with a black girl. You slept with a Filipino. Ain't nothing special about Filipino girl. Oh, wait, wait, wait. Ain't no Hawaiian's consideration too? That would be too. No. No. Like no. Hawaiians are Asians. They're Hawaiians. There's yeah, still Asians I can say. Okay, yeah, Asians. yeah, all right. Just two. Yeah. You still slept with two black girls. Oh, so that don't count. I'm talking about one out the Chinese store. No, hell no. All uh, right, then, nigga. Then oh, you ain't seen oh, with no Asians. Hell yeah, I'm with you. Yeah. Huh? Chinese store you damn well with. That, that makes more reason to do it, because that's the one and a half. So you slept with a Mei Ling. No, I said, I what's said, her name? you said, what was her name? You said, what was her name? You said, you said, so I'm, I'm taking, saying, I said, she had a fast. No, I'm talking about would. the one you slept with. What, what was her name? Her name? Yeah. It was, um, CNN. Yeah, so you know a nigga lied. When no. you said, when you no, asked him a question, no. no, when you asked him a question, and they answered the question with, the, with the same answer. What you said about the Mei Ling, and I was like, I was still, what was her name? Her name was Sienna. The girl. Sienna. Yeah. Sienna what? Jones? No. But she got a black name, but why would you call her? Listen, listen. That ain't, that ain't far-fetched. Don't act like they ain't. Don't act like don't. Cheeto, act. Cheeto got no. What was her last nurse. name? I don't know her last name. She just mess with her. Sienna. I don't know her damn last name. She just mess with her. I don't, I don't ask all your last names. That's all I care for. It's not my girl. You wait. So you don't ask none of these girls that you sleep with their last name? That's the first thing. That's not my girl. No, they're not special. No, she it's asked Joe. You gotta ask every girl. Yeah, yeah, that's right. That's right. No, you wouldn't. Yes, I will. Not you. I'm asking every girl her whole name. I don't ask her whole What's name. What's your whole name? I ain't asking. No. That's how you listen. That's how you break the ice with a lot of chicks. What? When you say, what's your name? That's the typical guy line. What's your name? Oh. And she'll tell you her whole name. Uh, Jenny. Jenny. Oh, that's hey, name? Jenny. I'm I'm Mark. There you go. I'm like, no. What last name? Hey, 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 hey. What's your, what's your whole name? Um, Jenny Tescapo. But why would she be a joke? Nah, she's 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 black. Black. She's I'm just saying black. they got to ask the chick a whole. She keeps saying she's black, like she's not black. She's so big, that's not black. <laughs> All right, bro. Hey. That ain't nothing special. I thought you okay. were talking about somebody from. I'm just saying somebody just from saying, uh, uh, Vietnam or something. That's still. Then you might say they're more black than anything. Yeah, because they look black, right? No, they're more. They're, oh my God, I'm, I'm good. Why you uh? Why you why you uh? Why you grab a toad dog to paper towels? Yeah. All right. Okay. So you ain't so you ain't so you not doing that. All right. So you so you all right. So you you diverse. You a diverse nigga. So all right. Okay. I got one more for you. I got one more for you. And now, and now, here's the real question. White girl, black girl, Asian girl, Spanish girl. All look good, all got fat asses, walk in the room. Right? <clears throat> you said you're going to talk to who first? Now, before you answer that, which one of those women you would rather spend the rest of your life with and have kids? Oh, man. Just by... Oh, shit. <laughs> See, you say I can't say individuals. So now I, 
Now I gotta go buy exterior. Oh, here we go. Here we go. Here we go. Ideally, we're talking about ideally, and you gotta give me the reason why. You can't just tell me what's name. Ideally, and when I say ideally, you can make up anything you want with any of these four women. Anything. It doesn't necessarily have to be what you went off of in your relationships Not from that back anyway. in the day. Because we all know you are old 65-year-old man. <laughs> <laughs> Tell me, which one would you choose to be with? And give me a scenario. And which one would you cheat on her with? <laughs> oh, God, evil, man. Um, all right, go ahead, man. Snow bunny. So you picking the snow bunny as the one I'm gonna be with? All right. So, 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 in your head, you want to be with a white woman for the rest of your life? With a, with a big ass. With a, with with a big stuff. ass. Yeah. Like, uh, what's her name? You don't you know every porn girl name? Don't act like you do. Sarah J. That's her name. Yeah. Like Sarah J. Okay, so like Sarah J. So you, so he's saying that he would be, you want to be with a white girl for the rest of his life. This is what you said. Like, yo, yo, you said this. I'm just saying, you said it. Like, what do you want me to say? You said you're also asking me why. You you said it. What do you want me to say? But why got my why? Yeah, you can't get your why. You said. <laughs> Since you put it that way, the white girl. <laughs> he tried to put it on me. Make all the black girls hate him. The white girl. Okay. So why? So why? Why would you choose the white girl over all the other three girls? And they all have the same attributes. And they all have the same, you know, things right. on their bodies. Family oriented. Oh, this is a deep one. <laughs> Oh my god, yo! My finances is right. <laughs> okay. And most likely, if they love you, they ain't with the bullshit. All the little oh, dumb drama man. shit. Damn. <laughs> yo. So, that's you, my three. You call me probably enemy number one. <laughs> <laughs> yo. <laughs> Get this nigga off this line. <laughs> Are you, yo, you can't be serious. So, <laughs> all right, so. Those same attributes that you gave her, or those same traits you gave her in your relationship, mm -hmm. you could have applied that to any one of those other women. Nah. But you chose. Mm -hmm. You wait. Mm -hmm. You can't, or you saying you saying it's that not, you can't. A lot of times it's not that way. Oh man! So we gonna. St this is about to get crazy. So okay. All right, Mister. So let's start with. We gonna start with the Asian girl. Yeah. Why can't the Asian woman? Do all the things that you just mentioned that the white girl can do. Damn, she has the same thing. Okay. Well, you said I couldn't individualize them, so I'm going by like. <laughs> what are you talking about? No, no, listen to me. Hear me out. You said I couldn't individualize them. So you know what that took from me? It took from me that I only can go by what I see most of the time with I these kind of women. I never said you couldn't individualize them. Okay, well, I'm individual. Okay, you okay. doing that? I never said. I said well, obviously you have to individualize them because you ain't gonna view all of them. Okay. I'm saying, well, you know, what I'm saying, you know, if uh, no, no, you can't change your answer. All right, cool. Well, you can't change your answer, sir. You didn't made the answer. You can't change it. I'm saying you, you, what's why would you choose the white girl? I already told you why. I would. Okay, you so tell me what. Tell me what an Asian girl lacks. Because you could have gave her all of those, but what did she lack that you couldn't have put her over the top? A lot of times they're too traditional about, they're too traditional. Like, a lot of times they won't, they won't break their tradition to try to like, you know, keep the family the way it's supposed to be and all that stuff. A lot of times they're growth, they're, and then if you know their fathers and mothers come into play, then you got to deal with all that shit. So now... Nah. So, so, okay, so you saying the reason why is because their fathers and mothers don't, and like, them. don't like niggas. Yes yeah. and no, like, they don't, I, I think a lot of them are starting to get over racism, but they have that little bit of, you know, 
quirkiness about it in them, and they don't want you to. They don't want to change their values and traditions. So that would kind of like All make right. me feel like nah. So 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 you so you wouldn't move forward with that. But I'm gonna come back. I'm gonna circle back around that because we're gonna get back to the white girl. Okay. So I'm gonna circle back around that. Okay. Cool. Because uh, you said something that I should have wrote it down, but I remember it. All right. The Latin girl. Why wouldn't you have chose the Latin girl and gave her the same thing, the same attributes, same traits, the same things in a relationship that you gave to the white girl? Why did you choose the white girl over the Latin girl? Nine out of ten. <laughs> You're about to be probably happy to be what he's right. Nine out of ten because what did we just say? Them and black girls are too close to me. <laughs> Oh my God, bro. <laughs> Yo, this guy is crazy. So wait, so you didn't choose the white, the Spanish girl because it's you, shit, she too close to the black girl. <laughs> shit. shit, I know about that shit. I know about that. <laughs> oh hell no. <laughs> so so you said she too close. So child, so, right, like, okay. So she too close. So I already right, listen. We gonna say the black girl, right? Mm-hmm. And I'm really interested in hearing your answer. I'm really interested in hearing your answer. Why would you have not chosen the black woman to be with, <laughs> even though the white girl, even though the white girl and the black girl have the same traits? Why would you choose? Y'all about to see that that joint with the Indian and say, "Please stay by." And say, <laughs> "Please stay by." Okay. All right. Just repeat what you said here. Why would I choose, why would I choose a black girl for what? Why would you choose <coughs> the white girl over the black girl and the black girl has the same trait and you can literally do the same thing? What made you choose the white girl? So I literally choose the same thing that you... Oh, no, Doug, you, come on. Okay, okay, change okay, it okay, up. Okay. Let's go. He's trying to get me killed. How am I trying to get you killed? This is a hypothetical oh, question. She's a black girl. So you chose. So what? What was your reason of choose? Come on, man, man up, bro. Come I'm on, man. Think, you like a punk, bro. You like a punk bro. Right now. Say, man. I just say said what I had to say. Why did you choose a white girl or the black girl and they have the same traits? Why? Basically, because white girls would have everything she don't have. Wait, <laughs> what? So bad with finances, she'll probably take you for yours. <laughs> Oh, that's crazy, yo. <laughs> yo, wow. So wait, let me get this right. So the reason why you ain't choose the black girl because you're afraid that she'd be the polar opposite yo, yo, of the white girl. Yo. And she would, you see how they got us off with like that? <laughs> they got us fucked up, man. Yo. Like for real. They really do. They really do. But it, but this 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 is your story and this is what you okay so so let's circle back around yeah we gonna get to the black girl later mm-hmm. but I want to talk about what you said about the Asian girl you said that family tradition a family tradition they kind of got a quirkiness I guess that's the word you use between yeah. two right yeah <laughs> so so let me get this right white people don't have a quirkiness. <laughs> Between black people. You're not giving them sin when I say that, man. <laughs> what? What I'm saying is, okay, okay, okay. Oh, you know, man. What, 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 what quirkiness do they have? Huh? Uh, no, uh, no, uh, no. Uh, <laughs> Wait, what? I, I won't finish. Let me finish. What quirkiness do white people have with black people? They have, huh? If we go to Thanksgiving, they, they eat cranberry sauce and we don't. We uh, go to Thanksgiving, uh, them okay, all right, so they have. Uh, okay, I get what you're saying. Man. I fully understand what you're saying. You're saying that. The white heat and the white tradition and the white people is a little more common, even though it's kind of like different. But we're more accustomed to white people than we are black um, uh, Asian people. So you already know if you go to a white, not necessarily, but in just saying um, opinion, opinionated mm-hmm. If you if you go to a, a white person's house on Thanksgiving, you automatically believe that the food is going to be bland and it's not going to be as the same. But you used to that. You're already used to that already. Yeah. We already know that that you in our heads, white yeah. people 
fried chicken is, isn't as good as black people's yeah. fried chicken, right? Or soul food or whatever. Mm-hmm. We kind of know that already. Yeah. It's not like, uh, so it's it's a, it's like we know it. It's already predetermined. When you go into an Asian house, you don't really know what's going on. Mm-hmm. So I get what you're saying. I get what but I don't mean that. Like I, that's part of it. But what I really mean is, okay, the craziest about what I mean about their traditions is they'll really try to, they'll actually try to. I, I've actually seen this happen. Cause I got a boy that has a girl that's um she's Vietnamese. Um, actually, uh, this dude's because I I ain't gonna say no names. I ain't gonna say no names. I don't say no names. But we know the guy. Yeah, we know his cousin. Yeah, we know the guy. Okay, so when I see, I, I, we went to a little joint they had her family, the girl's yeah. family, and. Later on, I, when I seen him and the father, like, blah, blah, back and forth, he told me, like, exactly what the conversation was about. And he said it's a consistent thing with him. Where, like, their fathers are real, like, strict when it comes to us. Because I guess you could say, I wouldn't say race, I would say prejudice. Like, they're, they're real oh, strict. Okay. Like, oh, come on. Man. Like, on some, like, there we go. They, they're real strict with stuff like that. Okay. And it's like, like, it's like, you got to, like, kind of, like, get on board with them. But if you tell them, yo, like, what about how I feel? Yeah. It's kind of like, nah. So you so you so saying not, so you, you know, saying you saying so shit, you bro. saying you saying so you saying that white you saying that white uh white families fathers just let you do whatever with their daughters not really <laughs> no 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 but, right, listen, but it's like uh, you said but it's like you said it's they, yours now but it's like you said let's say racist let's the fathers racist yours. they're more they're more like you know you can like. I guess more convenient with what they do, or they, or they have they have less like more influence, lenience. yeah, or less lenient, more leniency. Like they so like right. look here, man. Like you ain't like okay. They're not that deep with it. I got you. Know you. Know I got you. They more. Right, I got one more you know question. The last question. I got one more question for you. All right, and don't be acting like a, a, a punk. I'm not tell you the truth. Don't act like a punk, man. You know what's that game? They like get lost, punk. <laughs> Remember that game? What was that? River City? Not River City Ransom. Renegade. 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 Get lost, punk. <laughs> Man, I, I, was, I was so excited for that game when, they, when I heard it talk. I said, damn, the game talk. <laughs> now the game's full conversation. <laughs> all right. Out of all of those women, I actually got two questions for you. Okay. It's a two part question. <laughs> Out of all of those women, white girl, fat ass look good, black girl, fat ass look good, Asian girl, fat ass look good, Spanish girl, fat ass look good, who would you have a baby with, and which one of those women would you use it? No. Would you rather raise your child if you got locked up? Crickets. <laughs> How, a hard one. How? How is that a hard one? That's where they all got. You know. Okay. Well. Oh, here we go. Here we go. With the, here guess, we go with the I guess economics. I'm, I guess I'm about to be talking woods. <laughs> what do you mean? <laughs> so, so let me get this right. Hold on. Let me get this right. So let me get this right. Let me get this right. So you break in. So you going to have a child with the white woman because you because you believe that she has the best ability to raise your child if you lock them. Yep. Damn, that's hard. Not even just the best ability, probably he'll have the like best living conditions or everything like that. <laughs> oh, she don't, don't she don't try to crash. Oh man. She wouldn't be on trouble. I can crash. cut you down right now, but I ain't gonna, I'm gonna let you live. <laughs> really could cut you down. <laughs> oh man. Alright, so I'm gonna give you I'm gonna give this this is the last one. I'm gonna give you three three white women. Uh, uh a couple of black one black woman, a white woman, and one and one Spanish woman. Mm-hmm. And I'm gonna ask you, who would you have a baby with out of those three women? First one, Chelsea Clinton. Okay. Would you have a baby about Chelsea Clinton? Well, I don't see why not. <laughs> I, I would not. <laughs> <laughs> that bitch ugly as shit. Well, you said a baby. You said what? I, yeah. No. <laughs> Nigga, no. Damn ugly. 
<laughs> yes, he is. <laughs> Yo, I you kidding said, me? I thought you said niggas were Asian. Yeah, no, I'm not a nigga. No, <laughs> I'm a different species of a black man. I'm not a nigga. Trust and believe that. No. Chelsea Clinton's got that dick, but she's not fucking ugly. Chelsea Clinton is terrible looking. Look at that right now. Look, you can look it up on Google. You can look it anywhere. She ugly as hell. She's ugly, bro. She's ugly, bro. Ugly. Come on, bro. Don't do this. There's a bunch of white women that are beautiful. Okay, well, name She's on. not beautiful. You know what I'm saying? All right. So I'm going to Hell yeah. Shallow niggas, man. So Hell yeah. Jumping on it. I'm sorry, but you just said Chelsea Clinton was ugly, bro. What you yeah. talking about? Because she is. But you said I'm shallow. All right. Why would you have a baby with Selma Hyatt? Oh, shit. That badass yeah, bitch. Yeah, 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 yeah. Like shit. I said. <laughs> yeah. Mm-hmm. Okay. Next. 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 No. Do you want me to say Serena? Nah, go ahead. Next one. Next one. Next one. Venus Williams. <laughs> I have a baby my Chelsea guy with my Venus. Because why? She do got Chelsea B. She cute? She's okay. <laughs> Venus Williams is not okay looking. Okay. Venus Williams is ugly, bro. Yeah, Don't ugly. do this, bro. Come on. Okay, next one. You ain't no next one. You name someone. Ain't no next one. Okay, no. Yeah. No, you got not think Asian girl. I don't. I'm. Uh, what's the name? Lucy Lou. I don't know no Asian girls. Lucy Lou. You know Lucy yeah, Lou. Yeah, what happened with my Lucy Lou? Lucy Lou is okay looking. I have with my Maggie Q too. You know what that is? So a girl has to be cute for you to have a baby by? No, I'm just saying in general, man. Like, no. Well, yeah. Um, Nobody want ugly kids. What's that? What's her name? The girl from uh, the Jetty movies? The one that's on Shield? I don't know her name. I'm just saying. Here we go, looking up stuff. I think it's Ming Wen, right? I don't know her name, man. <laughs> so just remember, black girls is all on Ming his page. Win, all y'all black girls is no. You ain't trying to have no kids with y'all. I got to, but you're wrong. And. That's me, no one. Oh, yeah, she all right. <laughs> yeah, hold on. Let's put that up to the camera. Yeah, this is your girl. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, she, yeah. <laughs> Babies are <all> rust. <laughs> I'm going to tell you right now. Yeah, it won't be no pulling out. It's black to lack. It's black to lack. <laughs> okay, man. Put it up. You know what it is.